you want to watch 60 minutes of me CSing and you know stuff like that. I'm, I'm so close to my four staff, but I'm just gonna get my I'm just gonna get a TP scroll because I want to get back into the action. Okay, so here we go. Back into his action. Doom is taking a shitload of damage. Jarcopter seems to be doing pretty good actually. Can't really global ult. Uh, Better right doing some pressure. It looks Doom's completely fine. I'm just gonna sit on my power treads here. Oh my god, I fucked that up. Easily done. That's too bad. That's too bad. Watch and learn. I'm frustrated. That's the problem with doing uh, I use W some of the time, it's a little bit more fun for orb walking, it's a little more precise. I mean, I don't know. I, I wish there was an easier way to toggle on hotkeys and stuff, but there is not, so. I should have gotten a double kill there, but I fucked it up. Um, so Life Stealer's not happy. Which is understandable. Easily done. Very Keep thinking I'm playing Enchantress. It's kind of funny. It's like Fat Raiders can eat that. Let's see how much int I have. Um, six int stolen. So I'm gonna buy that four staff. If I can find it. So four staff, and let's get. Some salves and TP scroll. And I'm tanking creeps or something. Looks like I'm just getting hit by one creep, not a big deal. Um, so yeah, so it'll be four staff, salves, and yep, that'll work out. So I just want some more HP, basically. There we go, got it. That was close. <laughs> was not paying attention for a second there. If you can kill those rockets, it's so nice. So yeah, this is just kind of like a good execution to item builds and stuff like that. You want to be able to look at what is going to be dangerous to you. I mean, it's going to be impossible for me to die now, by any means. Like, I really, I would be very surprised if I get taken out. Maybe if I get like a gyro rocket or something at the perfect time, and uh, then his teammates follow up, I could die then for sure. But, um, yeah, it's 14 to 3, this game's super over. But basically, this is just a good way to play Silencer. You gotta look at what you're fighting against. Um, you can get like a mechanism, stuff like that. But basically, I'm just gonna use, um, you know, I'm just gonna use this Force Staff to escape all danger. Oh, well, I guess they're already gone anyways, but they're still Thrall. I think you can Force Staff out of Kinetic Field. I'm pretty sure you can. I think it just counts as like a, a ledge or something. I'm not completely sure. I don't actually follow mechanics. So I'm sure the mechanics people will just be raging right now because I just said that, so. Too bad, Damon. So yeah, next item, I'm going to finish my Django, just an early build out, and getting an early bracer is a great idea. You can do like 100, 6 times 19, whatever that is, it's uh, just under, it's 114 HP. How's that for on the go math that I always fuck up? So I actually need 750 plus 450, and that's going to be 8, 1200, so I need 75 more gold before I can actually get, um, Yeah, I need uh, 25 more golds. I need one more CS before I can actually finish my... Pick that one up. Here we go, 45 damage, 45 gold. Alright, so now I can finish my Django. And we can have some fun owning noobs in the jungle. I don't know what he's talking about, oh god. Whoops. Not paying good attention, unfortunately. So I can almost two shot a range creep. That sucks. Easily done. Actually, a little level. So I'm gonna pop this cell as a creep is chasing me. So I guess I'll just, you know, run in a circle for a little bit here. There we go. Full HP. Hell yeah. All right, and they're actually coming for me. No, maybe they're not. God, I wish this creep wasn't here. So that was like the perfect time to ult, pretty much. I was a little scared that he was going to get his shit off. And by him, I mean... Oh fuck, I just put a TV scroll on someone else. Alright, 
Watch and learn. I thirst for magic. Get on with it. It's come to this. I'll handle it. Easily done. Leave it to me. Watch and learn. Easily done. Leave it to me. Alright, so I just wanted to get as far away as possible from Ursa here. Watch and learn. God, I wish I could have been like right there. I could have gotten that kill probably. So there you go, getting another two int. Nope, I want stats, I said it, I'm doing it. So I'm gonna go home quick. I'm gonna pick up that mechanism next, I think is a smart choice because uh I need a little bit of tank, and that's most definitely going to give it... Me Mech is just such a great item, you guys, seriously. It gives me armor, it gives me stats. I mean, that's plus four stats right there. That's damage, that's armor, that's... It's just beautiful, seriously. Now, normally you could be raging because I don't have a TP scroll, but I just used one, so it's not the worst thing, and I'm just going to stand over here and kill enemy heroes anyways. So, there we am. Sitting on pretty beast items by all means. I mean, look at my HP and my mana right now. I can global silence and like non-stop glaives, and it's not going to make a big difference. So, I could get, I could max out curse with silent, but um, I think the mana cost goes up with the level, so it's really not a big deal anyways. And it only increases by 20 damage and 10 mana burn, so it's whatever, not a big deal. Um, yeah. So I'm about 500 gold from that mech, and now I'm gonna get my mech in uh, 700 gold or 70 gold. But we're gonna clear out this tower, and I'm gonna pick up this. Wow, that was close. <laughs> Almost ran into it. So yeah, there's power of the force staff. I just got him out of danger. That's a huge, uh, huge impact. Alright, looks like we get the pick off. I'm gonna grab my mechanism. And we're gonna finish up this tower. So that's pretty much the end of the game. Um, and by pretty much, I mean it's been the end of the game for a while, but that's just really good uh, silencer pr principles. This is not like a me owning game. These guys are really bad. Uh, Thrall wasn't horrible by any means, but. I mean. Stats. Give me that. Damn it. Um, next, I'd probably go a sheepstick. All right, and that's the end of the game. So thanks for watching, guys. Um, like I said, not the best example of any game, but um, those are the sounds or principles that you should learn if you do a solo mid. You want to try to save your skills for other possibilities. Just use Curse at, like, level 2 to maximum effectiveness. As you saw there, I only had to put two skill points in there, and it 100% won me the lane. Thrall could have done more last hitting and stuff like that, but he was afraid of me cursing him, I guess. And I did have more regen than him at that point, so I could have just kind of, you know, auto-attack him. He auto-attacks me, but I had more regen, so... So that ended up working really good, and uh, there might be stats, but um, always be aware of what people you're fighting, and uh, winning the lane, that's the solo silencer, and thanks for watching, guys.